for this week's Bushel Up, I'd like to welcome you to the month of April in Nebraska. Um, you know, April is the month we like to uh, start planting, uh, but in typical Nebraska fashion, rarely does the weather cooperate uh, and give us uh, these nice warm days. We're out here, uh, wind blowing, uh, a little bit of rain, not enough to amount to anything, you know, just enough to make it miserable. And as always, the wind's blowing. Uh, but when we look at uh, when's the right time to plant, obviously we look at soil conditions, soil temperature, soil moisture. Uh, and then we factor in the forecast and, and what kind of conditions are we looking at for the next uh, 10 days. Obviously we want to get that crop emerged. Uh, we don't want it to sit in the ground very long, so we want to, we want to find that favorable window. Uh, soil temperature, obviously uh, here this morning I'm pulling about 45 degrees at Aurora. Uh, you know, you can go to the uh, local uh, grocery store, hardware store, get yourself a, uh, a cooking thermometer. Uh, I do not recommend uh, borrowing your wives from the uh, kitchen. Uh, literally on in my marriage, I forgot to return that and that caused some, some grief for me. So uh, get your thermometer, uh, go buy a new one, they're cheap, uh, and you can take your own soil temps. Typically, you know, you want to go in that two to four inch range. Uh, we like to do it in the morning, that's usually the coldest. Uh, you'll see if we get sunlight and, and warm temperatures during the day, they'll warm up 10 to 15 degrees. Uh, but really, we're looking at that average. Um, we report 8 a.m. temperatures. Uh, and we share that. So if you're curious and you don't have time, uh, we do pull from the Nebraska Mesonet, uh, Colorado, South Dakota, and put that information together for you. We also calculate the weather, uh, kind of give you what the, uh, the weatherman saying is uh, for, uh, for a forecast. So, um, you know, typically we like to see, uh, you know, those warmer nighttime temperatures. Um, our experience says, you know, when we get down, still like uh, they're predicting here for the next few days into the mid 30s, uh, drop below 40 degrees, it's just really hard to get that, that consistent soil temperature and find those ideal conditions. So even if we hit 70 in the day, um, it's more about that nighttime temperature that really fluctuates your soil. So uh, just a few things uh, to be looking at. Uh, obviously uh, there isn't anything on the horizon that says uh, get the planters in the field. Uh, we'll see where we're at next week, but as I look out, we're only calling for about 50 GDUs over the next 10 days. So. Um, we're going to sit tight, um, hope you all do too. Uh, we got a little time yet. Uh, it's when we get to the end of April and we can't get that window that we get nervous. So uh, if you got any questions, reach out to us. Uh, we're here to help. Um, we keep this information to all our locations, so reach, reach out to your local rep and uh, we can get you our GDU and, and temperature updates.